Thank you very much. Powerhouse time now this week. What your money buys you in Washington, D.C., my hometown. Evan Johnson is an agent with Colwell Banker, been in the D.C. market since way back in 99. Let's take a closer look at some of the metrics on the D.C. metro. So far this year, over $3 billion worth of property has been sold. The average selling price, 427,000, over 8,000 units sold. The median selling price, about 355,000. Uh, that is uh, on about 9,000 sales. The average days on the market, 59. Let's go to the first listing. Uh, Evan, uh, take us to it. It's on Otis Street in, uh, I guess, Northwest 719 Otis. Absolutely. Uh, this is a property in Columbia Heights neighborhood of uh, Washington, D.C. Um, it's more of an entry-level type property. Um, it's close to transportation and everything, which is very, very important. It has four bedrooms, two full baths, and uh, been recently renovated. has a lot of charm from the history side of it when it was built in 1920. Um, but it uh, has a little bit more modern floor plan. Is Columbia for Heights up off of Columbia Road near Adams Morgan? People might know that neighborhood. Or, or yeah, yeah, it absolutely is. All right, very interesting. Those are, we used to call those row houses in D.C., uh, it, but they've obviously been uh, renovated. This is an old classic D.C. row house, right? It, it definitely is, and they are still row houses. Um, this one just has a, a nice renovation to it. All right, let's go to 1010 Massachusetts Avenue, a burgeoning area, condo 625, uh, and uh, it, uh, there, there it is. Tell me about it. Yeah, 1010 Mass. Uh, this is one of the premier buildings in downtown D.C., really halfway between the Capitol and White House next to the K Street Business District. This unit is a one-bedroom plus den, two baths, but really lives like a uh, two-bedroom with about 1,056 square feet to it. Uh, 1010 Mass has a beautiful rooftop deck, pool, uh, barbecues, seating areas for entertaining. It also has a 24-hour uh, concierge for anybody's needs inside. Sort of in the area of the uh, convention center downtown, right? Yeah, about a block and a half away from that in the uh, new uh, Marriott Marquis. And, and relatively close to the Verizon Center where you can go watch the Capitals if you choose to. Uh, you <laughs> don't want exactly to go see the right. Wizards. Uh, let's go to what we're calling now the powerhouse of the week. Uh, uh, 15 8th Street Northeast, price $1.4 million, five bedrooms, been on the market 25 days. Tell me about this and the neighborhood. Yep, it's the Capitol Hill neighborhood, so it's really a lot of uh, politicians. We're about eight blocks from the Capitol itself. This property uh, went through an absolute complete redevelopment and renovation in 2012. The owner's unit, which is the top two floors, is three bedrooms, um, two and a half baths, open kitchen with a uh, gourmet appliances, backyard, as well as a uh, two car garage, which is pretty uncommon in this area. Um, everything's basically brand new behind the historic facade look at of this that. property. That's a ni and light filled also. Look at that with the skylight. Look at the the uh, kitchen with the uh, with now the that's, washer. Yeah, that's actually an income unit in the lower level for a lot of staffers. Oh, for the I mill. see. Oh, interesting. Okay, fantastic. Well, we thank you for being with us. We, uh, and uh, there, if you're interested in Washington D.C., you know the guy to see. Uh, he'll take you to some of those listings. We'll uh, we'll be back with more powerhouse next week. Michelle.